And now, News Channel 10's 24-7 local weather first alert forecast. Hi, Kevin Selly in the Weather Center. We have two chances for some scattered showers. Nothing particularly heavy here, especially with this first chance with some light rain possible. Mainly the morning hours on Thursday. By afternoon, the little disturbance springing the rain will have moved on to, to western Oklahoma. Clearing skies behind it. We'll put the rain chance around 30%, 61 for the high, so still pretty mild above average for this time of year. You can kind of see the two disturbances, one over New Mexico lifting northeast, so that's the first one that goes across the panhandle. And then we've got a spin out in the Pacific Ocean, hmm, west of where it says Los Angeles. This is similar to, in some ways, the winter storm that came through a couple of days ago. No wintry storm or precipitation from this one, but it's another cutoff low pressure area. It's separated itself from the jet stream, and it is just sitting there. Yesterday it was moving along and maybe drifting a little bit to the south, again, west of Los Angeles. But eventually it will come inland. Right now the best chance for that to bring us some rain is on Saturday. But these cutoffs, when they sit there, sometimes they'll slow down, confound the models a little bit. So we're going to go with Saturday right now and reserve the right to amend the forecast. Here comes the first disturbance, though. As I mentioned, mainly the first half of the day on Thursday. Some light rain and a little band that goes across. There's around daybreak, eastern half of the panhandle. And then by early afternoon, it has largely moved on into Oklahoma, as I mentioned. We'll see some clearing behind it. And that will set us up for a fairly quiet day coming up on Friday. Rain chance is about like this. Darker green in the east, 30 to 40 percent chance for light rain. Could there be a rumble of thunder? Yeah, maybe 20 to 30 percent through the central portion of the region. Lesser chance in the eastern parts of the panhandle. So we'll go with that 30 percent rain chance, 61 for the high. Quiet day on Friday. Better rain chances depending upon the speed and the conditions and the behavior of our cutoff low out in the Pacific. 60 percent rain chance there and some cooler air starts to come in as well. 57 on Saturday, then only 48 with a lingering small chance for a shower or two on Sunday Then Christmas Day on Monday. You may hear on social media somewhere that there's a chance for some wintry precipitation. That is true. It's a non zero chance and mainly the northern portion of the Texas Panhandle, the Oklahoma Panhandle on late Sunday or Christmas Day. Again, the chance is not zero, but it's pretty close at this point. We'll, of course, watch the models and keep you posted. Still a chilly day, though, with a north wind and a high of only 47 on Christmas Day. And we bounce back closer to average in the low 50s for the middle part of next week.